Hello, OHEMA members. I am Alonzo Blackwell, and I'm on the Membership Engagement Committee of OHEMA. Today's interview is part of a video series we are calling Who's Who in Northeast Ohio, where we feature one of our members from OHEMA. Today's interview features a member from Metro Health Medical Center. I'd like to welcome Marcia Martin, who is from Metro Health Medical Center. So hi, Marcia, thanks for being part of our video series. Hi, Alonzo, thank you. So to start off, tell me a little bit about you. Who is Marcia? Um, my name is Marcia Martin. Um, I'm a recent graduate of uh, Cuyahoga Community College Health Information Management Program, where I obtained my associate's degree in HIM. Um, I have my RHIT. Uh, shortly after graduating, I began my career at Metro Health Medical Center as a release of information specialist, um, where I did that for approximately two years, six months. Um, I have I advanced a supervisor, which I've been in this role for 10 months. And so I've been in the industry for a total of three years and four months. OK, awesome, awesome. So uh, tell me a little bit about the culture of Met uh, Metro Health and what do you like about it? And, and do you find them to be very supportive to HIM? Yes, um, I love Metro. Um, very um, influential, a lot of influential people are here, um, encouraging, motivating, um, goal oriented. Um, any, they would do anything to help you progress. Um, I'm glad I, I'm glad I'm here. Awesome, awesome. OK, so can you share with our viewers what a day in the life of uh, medical records HIM is like for you? <laughs> uh, so I get to work about 7.15 in the morning. Um, the staff, um, I have 11 team members, uh, health information associates and release, release of information specialists. Um, so I get here about 7.15 in the morning where I begin the process of assignments, daily assignments. Um, checking my calendar uh, for WebExes, uh, consult with my manager, see what it is she wants done for the day, and basically whatever comes up, you know, um, nothing is ever really carved in stone, <laughs> as you know. Um, yes. We just take each day as it comes, you know, and it's a every day is good. You, you know, it's good. It's not a bad job. It's not hard. It's a thinking position. So you have to be good with critical thinking. That's, okay. that's what I like most about it. Very good. So what got you interested in the HIM field? Um, I was a medical assistant a long time ago. <laughs> I left that and got into retail. But I always wanted to come back. I wanted to work in the hospital. I didn't want to do hands on clinical with patients, but I wanted to do something. So um, talking to some people and, you know, regarding behind the scenes type jobs. And so medical records came up. So they said, hey, Tri-C has a good program. You might want to check into that. And that's what I did. OK, awesome, awesome. So how do you keep current in your profession? What, what do you consider your go to resources to stay on top of things? Uh, OHEMA website, OHEMA website. Um, here at Metro Health, they have uh, what's called the LEAP modules, um, learning programs. Web, um, you know, uh, each of those three, you can go on and get your continuing education credits units, um, which is required, as you know, to maintain RHIP. Um, my director, uh, she is very informative. Um, basically, the, those are my four, <laughs> top four. Okay, very good, very good. So 
I know you haven't been in the field that long, but even being in the field is, is constant changing, as you know. What's been the biggest change you've seen since you've started? Oh, definitely from paper to electronic. It's amazing. Um, you know, because like I said, I started off as a medical assistant. It was a three physician office and um, we, it was paper. You know, and to come from that to now being everything electronic, um, it's amazing and it's very convenient. Okay. Very convenient. All right. So what about career aspirations for the future? Where do you see yourself in five years? Well, I, I, I do love being a supervisor. I think it's the perfect fit for me. But um, of course, as time progresses, if something a little higher up the ladder presents itself, I think I'm going to go for it. OK, good. Good for you. So now, are you a member of OHIMA? Yes. And if so, how long have you been a member? Two years. OK, awesome, awesome. Um, do you think OHIMA has helped you in your career? And if yes, how so? Um, well, like I said, I, I go to the website for the WebExes and, um, you know, career investment, um, reading, uh, documentation, things of that nature. Um, it's good for reference. Okay, very good. So we all know that uh, our profession is all about change. What advice would you give a colleague or a coworker on dealing with so much change? Uh, stay focused. Um, because you can get distracted so easily because there's so much going on. Um, when dealing with change, stay focused, stay grounded, um, be realistic. Um, have realistic expectations. Um, don't try to rush through anything. Um, just accept it, you know, take it day by day. Okay. Good. So as we close, if someone were to, someone were to come up to you asking about a career in HIM, what would you tell them or what advice would you give them about the field? Um, I would tell them it's, it is a serious career. It's a serious field. Um, I don't think that people know the depth of um, what we do with dealing with medical records. Um, and they, they can grow. It's a lot of room for growth. It's a large umbrella, a lot of careers up under this um, uh, HIM umbrella. And I, I would, I would, I would advise them to take the route I took. Go to track two, take the course, uh, come out, you're going to get a job. And just go from there. Allow yourself to grow and expand. Definitely worth it. Awesome, awesome. Anything else you want to share with us while we have you? Um, no, it's good seeing you again. <laughs> good seeing you again as well. Awesome to see you. So I want to thank uh, Marcia for joining us today from Metro Health. It was a pleasure getting to know how things are going at Metro and some more of your story. And um, I'm sure our members will enjoy it too. So I'm Alonzo Blackwell from the Membership Engagement Committee wishing everyone a fabulous day.